Before we get into today's video, I've got three things for you. Number one, if you want to get a notification whenever we post a new video, make sure you ring that bell. Number two, there's a TCG Player affiliate link in the show notes. After clicking that link, every purchase you make on tcgplayer.com helps support this channel. Number three, you'll also find a link to our Patreon where you can support us directly. And now, kick back and enjoy the show. What is up, everybody, in wonderful spike land of quarantine out there? Uh, here we are today, and as you can see mm, there on That's our amazing. screen, we've got we've got a special guest today. So joining me, we've got Jen. You know him. We've got Alex. Alex, you know him. And we've got um, my personal favorite person uh, in this uh, video right now, Benjamin Wheeler. Mm -hmm. Uh, we're gonna play uh, some uh, cowboy magic today. Hopefully, some some fast and loose uh, CDH. Yep. Uh, and Jan is going first in turn order. Jan, what you got today? Yeah. Uh, so as I said, I'm going first today. I'm playing Thrasios and Bruce Tall. Uh, it's a um, Eldritch Evolution pod type deck. So you basically are just gonna like pod and neo form into your uh, combo pieces and hope to flicker your dockside extortionists and make a whole bunch of mana and kind of go from there draw your deck with thrasios and hope you win the game that's my plan i do like hope winning the game <clears throat> wheeler uh i've got a thalia guardian of thraben deck it's a mono white death and taxes um just for the record i haven't played a massive amount of cdh but I have played a massive amount of Thalia. Um, usually it's with Mox Pearls. However, uh, instead of that, I get to apparently add a bunch of like sideboard enchantments and they're really good. So I'm excited for that. Um, I did make it so that my deck is more aggressive though. So like I'm going to be killing people and I'm going to be tapping basic planes. That's Very good. nice. Yeah. I like both of those Very things. Nice. Alex. Yeah, uh, as you can see right here. Great, great, great here. Uh, I'm playing we'll, we'll Aurelia War Leader. Um, and uh, this one's my Aurelia Helm deck. It's uh, a little staxy. Uh, it's going for the combo of Helm of the Aurelia. And so we've got some pieces to help us get there, along with uh, survive some uh, better color pairings that might be at the table. Uh, and I'm playing Grenza, Dungeon Warden. I'm going to build some Doomsday Piles upside down and hopefully uh, not do it incorrectly um yeah so without further ado we'll uh get into it here for you all right so i'm gonna draw for my turn i am going to start off with a command tower and then pass the turn all right draw <clears throat> gonna play snow covered plains and cast a benevolent bodyguard Oof. oh i love that guy <laughs> and uh, pass the turn. Right on. That was one of the first cards I ever saw when I started first started playing when I was like third. Yeah, the uh, the judgment theme deck <laughs> had uh, I think three or four of them. That sounds right, actually. Yeah, I, actually, uh, that might have been what I got it in. Uh, yeah. Plateau and pass. Oh, uh, all right. I will draw for my turn. Ooh, Ooh that's actually interesting. Um, I'm going to play this basic swamp mm -hmm. and I'm going to cast an Imperial Seal. Ooh. Ooh, interesting. Any effects from the nope. non blue decks at the table? <laughs> <laughs> no, we good. All right. That's all good. Thumbs up. I'm going to put this card on top of my library. You guys don't get to see it, but I did. And I'm going to go to 38 life. And uh, pass the turn. All right. I'm going to draw this card. Remember when we were all like, we're going to play aggressive magic? <laughs> I played a one mana creature. I play this Waterlog Grove. Uh, then I'm going to take a damage to add a uh, green. I'll add a blue with my command tower and cast Kinnon. Oh, Wonder Prodigy. One. I guess it, it technically doesn't do anything right now, but. No, 
but presumably still a two- in, in the future it it will <laughs> it blocks wheelers one one oh yeah you're right <laughs> got him uh, uh, um i'm gonna play a flagstones of trocare oh attack elliot for one <laughs> That's it. Uh, first and last time you're on the show, bud. You've got to be <laughs> kidding me. Come back anytime. You're oh, doing thanks it just for right. Ha- hey, hey, thanks for having me, by the way. Anyways, here's a Thalia. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll cast uh, Thalia on my commander, and I will pass. Right on. Play this planes. I will rue the day that we invited Wheeler and pass. Oh, can't cast his... Uh, Talisman or something now. <laughs> something. Uh, I'll draw this card that I put on top of my library and uh, may live to regret. Uh, then I'll play this Cavern of Souls. Mm. Uh, I'm going to name Goblin to the shock of uh, hopefully no one. And uh, add a red, add a black, and cast a, a Goblin. His name is Grenzo. And he you could also the... named Rogue. I could, yes, but I'm going to name Goblin. <laughs> That's fair. Uh, yep, uh, X is zero. So he doesn't get any counters, but uh, I will pass the turn. All right, I'll untap and I will draw. Who boy. That is uh, not a card I wanted to see. <laughs> uh, so I'll take another pain uh, going down to 38, and I will cast Thrasios, yet another blocker. For the threats Wheeler is putting on the board. Uh, These green blue uh, dudes. Then I think I'm just going to hang back. Yeah, pass turn. Now I got to play something with three power. Wow, Thalia yep. has first strike. <clears throat> if he blocks it, does, yeah. she you, does, yeah. You got him. Uh, I'll play another snow covered plains. I don't know if I have many things with three power in <laughs> Um, all right, well, I'll attack uh, Elliot with Thalia and Alex with Benevolent Bodyguard. All right. Yeah, I, uh, I have no effects. Um, for my next trick, uh, I will play a Suture Priest. Oh. Oh, no. That one <clears throat> so uh, whenever a creature comes into play under my control, I gain a life. Uh, if it comes into play under your control, <laughs> you lose a life. Uh, go ahead. Seems, seems bad, considering I'm uh, probably attempting to make a bunch of zealous conscripts. That was yeah, good. I know. I just realized that, too. <laughs> Flickering creatures doesn't seem as good anymore. Just, just use your first zealous conscripts to take my suture priest, dude. I'm sure it'll be okay. Nothing yeah. could go wrong. Brain so Except for called. maybe everything. This torpor orb. Ooh. <laughs> oh wait. Huh. Wait. So torpor orb stops suture priest from hurting us too, right? Correct. And from wow. constructs. And, constructs. Constructs. and yeah, yeah. That that's a later problem now. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. I think that's my turn. Alrighty. I will. I mean, I'm that. still playing this because it's a two mana one one. You know? <laughs> I mean, uh, the the rate, know. how can you lose? Yeah, pressure is pressure. Uh, this is a little awkward. Just a little, though. Um, yeah, you know what? I can't block his Thalia anyway. Wheeler, attack you for two. This is unbelievable <laughs> and unwarranted, even. I'll take two. Perfect. Um, two Grenzo damage. Seven. Uh, I'm just going to pass the turn. All right. Well, I'm going to untap. Is this a land? It's not. Fabulous. Uh, well, I have to play a card or discard a card. So I'm going to take another damage. Hey, you guys don't need to attack me. I'm just killing myself. Yeah, perfect. I don't like that. Uh, I'm going to play this training grounds. Ooh. That is a strong one. Yeah. Uh, and then pass the turn. I mean, I'd like to attack, but I can't. Your creatures are just way too big. <laughs> yes. They're too good. Untap. I'll draw. Yeah, as if Ooh. they give, to give Thrasios three toughness, right? God. Yeah. 
It's because he, he only gets he was, one. He power. wasn't good enough, you know? He wasn't. Hmm. All right. I've, I've entered the stage of do I really, like, do I want to be invited back, I guess, is what <laughs> I'm trying to say. Listen, uh, if you don't try to kill us as hard as possible. Oh, I will. Yeah. Uh, it, it just might not be. I'm playing a Rishadin port. Yeah. Um, and uh, I will attack Elliot for four. Wow. Yeah. Uh, I can't really yep. argue it, I suppose. Go to 31. And then I'll pass. Alrighty. We'll do the untap upkeep, bro. I have uh, four Thalia damage, by the way. Ooh. Oh my. Yeah. You it's love like to see it. Two more than the Lorenzo damage you've done. <laughs> <laughs> Play this mountain. You got all your colors of mana this time. I do, which is very important in a multicolored deck. Mm -hmm. It is. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Pay three for a rest in peace. Ooh. Get these uh, graveyards out of here. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. My yeah, we wanted, say, we uh, Long games, right? Hey, yeah. I like the cut of your jib over there, you know? <laughs> what can I say? Uh, Stacks and tacks. Yeah, that's it, though. Pass it off. You're oh, playing yeah, so. the cards that I cut to make my thing more aggressive, so it all works out. <laughs> not that they're bad. Not that they're bad. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying I was like, you know what? I really want a Torpor Orb and rest in peace. And God, Lord knows I wanted an Uba mask, but I was like, Uba I wanted to, you know, I got to kill people here. Um, it's teamwork. Yeah, at the end of Alex's turn, I have to pay... Uh, this and for life because of the Thalia to try to dismember the Thalia. Uh, I'll uh, go to 27. I am going to sacrifice Benevolent Bodyguard to give my Thalia protection from black. Mm -hmm. Gets mm -hmm. exiled from Rest in Peace. Oh, Rest in Peace. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I have no effects to Rest or, uh, yeah. Yeah. that. No, no effects to, to anything <clears throat> ever. Untap. <laughs> Draw. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good. Good. Uh, mm -hmm. I will add a red with this Cavern of Souls uh, and cast a Goblin Sledder. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Big sleds. Uh, pass the turn. Oh, dope. Uh, untap. Um, in, your, in your upkeep, uh, I'm going to tap that command tower with my Rishden port. Please and thank you. Uh, I'm going to respond by activating Thrasia. Okay, dope. Oh, it does only cost two because of the thing. Training ground. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Scrap to the bottom and Haya. Finale of Devastation. It is not a land. Mm. I'm going to draw this card here. Also, not a land. Did you lose a one from your waterlogged? Oh, I did not yet. Correct. Go 36. Am I at 27 already? This this game sucks. Uh, absolutely you are. <laughs> um, Unbelievable. Complain. Let's make a fast game. R proceeds to die quickly and then complain about it. <laughs> uh, I am just going to proceed to my discard phase. Uh, at end of turn... I'm going to tap two and cast Enlightened Tutor. Ooh. Seems cool uh, for yeah. us. Yeah, no, no effects. Mm -hmm. I have found a copy of Umezawa's Jite. <laughs> yeah. Off of my Enlightened Tutor. Uh -huh. I will put that on top of my deck. I would like to untap. Oh, I'm going to discard cards first. Hang on. Oh, 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 oh true, true. So I'm going to discard this Finale of Devastation and a... Uh, Tezzeret the Seeker, because I'm never casting that spell. Yeah. Could you put that in exile for me real quick? Oh yeah, I can. Ooh. Look at that. Thank you. Uh, untap. Uh, draw this Umezawa's Shite. Uh, I'm going to play a Scavenger Grounds. Oh boy. Um, I'm going to tap three and cast my Umezawa's Jite. Yeah. Alex, any effects? Uh, I'm going to cry a little. Yeah, yeah, me too. Uh, I am then going to put my Umezawa's Jite onto my Thalia. Yep, seems good. 
Yep. Uh, Alex, I will attack you for three. That seems fair and balanced. Uh, Gta trigger puts two counters on Gta, and then I am going to pass the turn. Okay, we're getting just a little too fancy. Stable. I uh, don't <laughs> like it. Not one bit. So we're gonna play this planes. We just got some like really neat battle bond art. I really wish they'd done more Ooh. of this because like that just yep. looks cool, right? Anyway, uh, and then I hope this does something because if it doesn't, I'll be a little bit embarrassed. But uh, we're gonna cast a war's toll. Oh no! Oh, oh, hold, on. hold on, let me get my spectacles on that bad boy. <laughs> okay. War's toll says whenever an opponent taps a land for mana, tap all their lands. <laughs> If a creature an opponent controls attacks, all creatures that opponent controls attack if able. Ooh. Yep. Yeah, that's So okay. if you're going to tap something, you got to tap all of it. Alex, I got to tell you, bud, we're on the same wavelength. I like, well, I'm, I'm really picking up what you're putting down there. God, I, I just love it when a plan comes together. Oh, yeah. Unfortunate. For you? <laughs> yeah, for you're me. Good. I'm the one that matters. <laughs> <laughs> you're up, bud. All right. Untap my Cavern of Souls. Draw how, is this, how is this bad for you? It it takes all the thinking out of the game. And well, that's true. where you struggle the most, dude. So. <laughs> <laughs> you know what, pal? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> God damn. Uh, I'm going to play this Mana Confluence while I cry about my life. Um, I'm going to head to combat. Mm -hmm. And we're going to chunk Alex for trois. Ooh. Sorry, I don't speak uh, whatever that is. Oh, wee oui, wee. Oui. That's all I got. Um, and then uh, I have to tap all three of these anyway, so your war's toll has no power here, Alex the <laughs> White. I will cast this three mana talisman of indulgence. Ooh. Yeah. Um, pass the turn. Hold on. Uh oh. The, the Thalia that's out is the Tax Thalia, right? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, so we're, so we're still... Oh, okay. oh well, cheater, cheater, pumpkin, eh. cheater. How many YouTube comments What's up, YouTube comments? comments? I, only, <laughs> I only missed up. I'm going to say, I'm, how, I'm, how many do you think we got before you caught it? I'm going to go put the over-under at, like, three. Mm -hmm. They do like to type quickly. Mm -hmm. Mid-video. <laughs> Mid-turn. Mid yeah, exactly. Yeah. Uh-huh. That's actually an interesting one. I'm not mad about it. So I guess I'm going to add... Uh, uh, two. Two, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. And I, I'm, I'm trying to... I have to pick a color. Oh, colors. I was like... <laughs> Come on, Jan. Yeah, this doesn't matter. This actually... Okay, okay. It does. All right, I'll go 35. Um... I will spend the, uh, the I'll say green, I'll cast this Mox Amber. Mm. That's a good one with Keenan in play for sure. Yeah. I don't like. I might actually respond to you casting this one. Oh. Sure. Mm. <clears throat> Allow me to refresh myself on Keenan. Uh, whenever you tap a non-land permanent for mana, add one mana of any type that permanent produced, and then has an activated ability that costs seven. I will respond to you casting your Mox Amber. Sure. I would like to remove a charge counter off of Umezawa's Jite to give Keenan minus one, minus one. Yep. I would like to do that once more. For sure. Okay, okay. Seems right. Um, yep. Yeah. So, Mox uh, Amber's all good? Yeah, mm -hmm. no, I, or okay. Wheeler, no no more effects? No, no, yeah, yeah. we're good. Go for okay. it. Uh, so, I'm going to tap it <clears throat> for a uh, another white. Uh, and I'm actually, I'm going to Swords Thalia. Oh. Mm. Can you tap it for a white if you don't have... Uh, it's if as long as I oh I have a white for my command. Um, yeah. So I'm right, you had a white from that. Okay, white yeah. 
So and that get, one for the tax, right? Gotcha, and gotcha. Yeah, so one for the tax, yeah. Yeah, so Thalia gets swords. I'll throw her in the command zone. Plus one, and I gain two. Two, yeah. Uh, and then after that, I'm going to pass the turn. Spell table doesn't allow for commander tax, does it? No, uh, I don't think, think so. so. Okay. We'll have to remember to at them about <clears throat> it. <laughs> Dear spell table, um, untap, draw. Well, hmm. I can't help but notice how much of a big boy Thrasios is. Yeah, man. The, the big um, butt on that lad. The got a big booty. So they call him Big Booty. The absolute cheeks. <clears throat> oh, God. Don't oh. word it like that. Word it like that. Um, <laughs> I'm going to... Uh, I guess float a bunch of mana because of War's Toll. Uh, three of that is going to be white. Two of that is going to be uh, colorless. Um, which, which I was about to represent for the viewers at home with two white dyes. Um, I'm going to use one of them, uh, one of the colorless, to cast Soaring. Ooh. Mm -hmm. um, that's, I also just put the wrong number down there. Great. Thanks for having me, by the way. Yeah, um, as we've learned today, uh, numbers, not not the magic players. Uh, don't you? Necessarily. Don't, okay, thank God. You not just there. you. Jan did it too. Yeah, I get I get full like childish when it comes to like, <laughs> no, I can do arithmetic. It's all I have. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to tap four and cast uh, my commander, Thalia, Guardian of Thraben. Mm -hmm. um, and then I have two white remaining. Well, I feel as though I'm going to use those. Uh, yeah, I'll put. I'll use that too to equip my Suture Priest uh, with the Umezo SGT. Um, and then I will attack. Oh, God, stupid Thrasios. I'll attack Alex for one. Oh, so rude. Uh, I'm over here helping you out, playing your stacks pieces for you. Uh, look, I'm just getting. I'm, I'm making your death shadow bigger. Um, GT is going to trigger, putting two charge counters on here. Um, yep. I am then going to remove a charge counter to give Goblin Sledder. Actually, no. This is this is way too early. We've got time to wait. My apologies. Go ahead, Alex. Right. On. And a drop. All right. So Thalia is back. Yep. Thalia is back in Pog form. Is that like an EX or a Dynamax? I, uh, uh, I, re I regret everything. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> well, I didn't know that was your reset button. Anyway, we're going to cast Aurelia the War Leader. Ooh, mm -hmm. That is a creature Any spell. response? That is a big creature spell. <laughs> I mean, I'm going to, I'll applaud you because I, uh, I love me in Aurelia. I love me in my Aurelias too. Oh, yeah. Um, Gita can give minus two, minus two off that, right? Uh, yep. In total, yeah. Minus one, minus one per charge counter. And then plus two, plus two for up. And then yep. what's the other thing? Life? Uh, two life, yeah. Okay, so, yeah. Okay. yeah, two life, plus two, plus two on the equipped creature only. And then minus one, minus one on any creature. There we go. Yeah, sorry. It's, it's been a hot minute. Anyway, take six. The oh, take six. Okay, that's fine. That's a rally damage. Two. Or you can take two. So no, cute. God, oh no! I, if I could die by any of these commanders, I hope it's Aurelia. <laughs> no, it's gonna be I'm gonna work on that. Gonna um, gonna choke me with my your angel uh, thighs. What? what and happened? a turn. What do you mean? What happened? I got hit. I got hit for six. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, for not paying attention, I'm going to give your uh, Goblin Sledder minus one, minus one. Please and thank you. Uh, I will sack it to give. Grenzo plus one plus one, I suppose. Oh, oh he's popping off. Yep. He's going yep. for it. Okay. Unbelievable. Uh, untap. <laughs> uh, the plus one plus one wears off at the end of the turn. Uh, this was not as pog as I was led to believe it would be. <clears throat> I will draw. Please don't write Twitch chat as Dickens, dude. <laughs> it was wow, man. not as pog as led to be. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <sighs> 
Man, I, I don't know, man. It's it's pretty weird, champ, of you to say Pog IRL, dude. Oh, sorry. I'm referring to uh, the the great Pogliacci. Not. Uh... Oh my god! <laughs> I hate everything. <laughs> I hate everything. Uh, once again, thanks for having oh me on. God. Yeah, anytime. Yeah, this is our best episode. For, I've been looking forward to this in over a long time. Uh, how greedy do I want to be? Maximum. Oh, I can't. I can't do it the way that I want to do it. Gosh, if only, of the I, if only Elliot had three enablers to I hate you. <laughs> encourage him into his greed. Uh, I'm gonna take uh, one for the mana confluence for a red. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, that means that I have to tap these. So I have yep. uh, red, colorless, colorless, black. Uh, okay. Use use the red. Damnation. Overmaster. Uh, the next instant or sorcery spell that I uh, play can't be countered so by spells or abilities. You paid two for that, right, Elliot? Mm -hmm. Okay, good. good, good. Uh, draw a card. Oh, I'm actually pogging out of my mind. Oh, God. Uh, the other two mana will cast this soul ring. Unbelievable. Unbelie How does he do it? Uh, I can't attack anybody. Lame. Oh, I mean, you turn. can. It's just not <clears throat> a great yeah. idea. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I mean, you can technically attack Thrasios, right? Um, yeah. I suppose. Right. Well, you can attack into Thrasios. Yeah. Thrasios. Yeah. It is. It is a one three. You're right. But yeah. Uh, I'm but, just gonna uh, pass but I do have the GTA. I don't know what uh, the, the what's the cooperation level oh. of CDH. Oh. I mean that that seems like it's mid mid okay cooperation. Yeah. Level. I'm not yeah, doing it because like, it benefits Elliot. I'm doing yeah. it because it benefits me. Yeah. True. Okay. I'll go to combat. <laughs> I'll attack Jan. Yeah, I could also give Grenzo minus one minus one though, so that Thrasios kills it off. I oh should have mentioned God. that. But since the attack's being made, uh, if a block wants to be made, um, no, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take two. It's not falling. <laughs> sure. <laughs> oh, all right. You, the secret about traps is they usually have to be secret. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna pass the turn. All right, cool. I'm gonna untap. Draw this card. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna cast an Elvish Mystic. Oh. Mm, seems good. Uh, and I think I'm just gonna sit back. Um, hmm. I'm going to blow up the mystic. I mean, yes, <laughs> Ab absolutely. Uh, I'm gonna give the elvish mystic minus one minus one from the Uber's OSG time. Yeah. Uh, See, the most upsetting part about this is now Elliot's wide open to just like add counters to this GT. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> well, it doesn't have to do combat damage to a player anyway. Yes, it does. No, it does no, not. GTA's <laughs> any combat damage. Oh, okay. So he, yeah, like, he just puts it on the Thalia anyway. Cards cards a mistake. Uh, I'll draw for turn. You're right. Cards are mistakes. Uh, I'll Should play, play Snow-Covered Plains. God, it would make shuffling actually more difficult now that I think about it. Yeah. Um, I, guess, I guess I said that wrong. Or Did I say damage to a player? That's what I meant to say. I think I said combat damage. Yeah, you did. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I meant damage to a it. player. It is, it's combat damage. So yeah. It. Hmm. I am going to take some game actions. Oh, please, please do. Probably. Uh, it's one oh, of the best God. ways to avoid slow play. Jabated. Oh my God. I was about to say that's it, Alex. I'm attacking you with both of these. Yes, bring it, bring it. That's uh, not the plan. Uh, Elliot, mm -hmm. uh, I'd like to attack you with uh, Sutra Priest and Thalia. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I'm, I'm going to 22. I have four oh. Thalia damage. Six Thalia oh, like, damage. Uh, I believe six by I, now. I do believe six as well. Uh, two counters on my Umi's OSG Um <clears throat> As per War's Toll... Uh, I'm going to add four white and two colors to my mana pool. Uh, I'm going to use four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, I mean, you can't overextend, right, in this game. Um, no comments. <laughs> I'm going to use uh, three of this, I guess two colorless and one, 
to cast um Ooh, yeah, I'll cast Eldrazi Displacer. Displacer. Ooh. Uh, three mana, three, three, Devoid. I can play two and a colorless to exile another target creature and return to the battlefield tapped under its owner's control. Uh, and then I'm going to use three and uh, one of the two colorless off of Soul Ring. I'm going to cast Rule of Law. Uh, four oh. total uh, foul, yeah. So each player can only play, uh, can't play more than one spell each turn. Who invited this guy? You! Uh, you uh, yeah, no, I'm, 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 I'm. Ooh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's what oh. we like to see. Okay. Finally, some good food. Uh, and then I'm going to uh, pass the turn. Was that. Uh, that was which, a oh, that was two. Force to all pitching, is that Mystical Tutor or Brainstorm? Yeah, Mystical, mystical Tutor. Mystical Tutor, cool, cool, cool. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Um, is this not what you expected, though, when you invited me on? Like, I'm either going to try to bomber man as quickly as possible or attack with dorky white creatures. True, true. Play this Gaia Reach Sanitarium. Oh, yeah. I'm going to cast an Arcane Signet. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. uh, is is, is Wars, Wars Toll? Yeah, is Wars Toll opponent or player? It says opponents on it. Oh! Yeah. It's uh, asymmetrical for four. Anyway, uh, Wheeler takes six. Uh, yeah, I got a 28, and I've taken 12 Aurelia damage. Now hold on. Now hold, hold on. on. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Back up, We're back all up. sensible. We're sensible adults here. We can uh, <laughs> figure this out. Uh, my turn. Oh, he said, "Hold on." I thought there was. Oh, oh no, uh, no. I'm just. Um, oh, you're asking for mercy. But <laughs> yeah. Oh God. <laughs> no, yes. No, yes. No, 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 no. I. Um, I'm gonna pass. All righty. I will untap. Uh, draw for turn. Oh. Good, good. More, uh, more pain lands. Uh, City of Brass. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, so the Thalia is in play. Yeah. Yep. The Rule of Law is not. The Torpor Correct. Orb is, and the Rest in Peace is. Correct. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cool. Cool. Um. Yeah, can't attack anyway, I guess. So uh, black and two. I'm going to cast Diabolic Intent, uh, sacrificing my Grenzo Dungeon Warden and putting him back Ooh. in the command zone. Uh, you did tap a, uh, a swamp there, right? Oh, no, I did. Yep, so I do have to tap everything. You can tap your talisman. You, you gotta, yeah. You have a talisman. If you oh, a I can. Talisman. I can, I can, I can. Cool, 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 cool. I just have to take, uh, go to 21 mm -hmm. for that. Yeah, do it that way. Good call. Thank mm -hmm. you. Uh, any effects to intent? No. Nope. I'm going to put this card into my hand off of this diabolic intent. Yes, yeah, so what'd you get? Uh, you'll see, actually, pretty soon oh, here. Nice. I love seeing. Uh, so let's see. Do I want <laughs> to do this? Oh, that tickled me. <laughs> Uh, I don't. So I'm going to add uh, red and something, and then have to tap all of these. Uh, so I have to take two down to 19. For four mana total, I'm going to pay uh, the one for Thalia and two into the X of this by force, targeting Torpor Orb and Umazawa's Jite. That is solid. Yeah, that that gets me. Um, hmm. Any effects, Jan? Uh, I have no effects. Wheeler? Uh, Elliot, hmm. you only take one damage. Mana Confluence is if you add, you pay a life to add mana. Mm -hmm. it's a, yeah, okay, never mind. Sorry. Uh, yeah. I'm going to gain four life. Seems good. That's fair. Cool. Uh, that that is my contribution. 
It's a good contribution. Yeah, yeah that, that was pretty solid. Uh, pass the turn. All right, well, I'm going to untap. Well, we, Wheeler, put the put the jeet in the graveyard, bud. Yeah. Uh, actually, I'll put it in the exile zone. There. Oh, please do that. I, yeah. I was just waiting for you. <laughs> <laughs> so that I could say it wrong. <laughs> yeah. That's how petty I am. Uh, I'm going to pay one life to make a green. I'm going to make a red. Uh, and I'm going to cast a dark side extortion. Ooh, oh, something. no. I played myself by killing the Torpor Orb. Congratulations. Uh, uh, artifacts, right? Artifacts and enchantments. I've got two. So, and then Wheeler's got one, so that's six. <clears throat> Elliot, you've doomed us all. I have. Uh, yeah. Suture Priest is still on the field, so lose a life. Yes. Oh, uh, it's a man. I would, like to, I would like to have you to uh, lose a life, please. Sounds good. I'll lose a life. Yeah. Look, we're going <laughs> to play this right. Future Priest is a May. I think I'm just going to pass. Yeah, I'll pass the turn. I've got a really bad joke based off of that, but I will save the Spike Feeder audience from it. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Maybe, yeah. maybe next time. Uh, untap. Draw. Elliot. Yes. I don't know what to tell you, bud, but you, uh, well, you messed with the wrong gamer. Uh, I'm going to, extortionist is a one, two, correct? Correct. Groovy. Uh, Jan, I'll attack you with the, uh, displacer and Elliot, I'll attack you with suture priest and Thalia. Yep. Yep. I'll go to 16. Yep. Um, I have eight Thalia damage. Show off. Um, and then I will pass the turn. Okie dokie. Uh, actually, in your end step, we are going to activate Gaia Reach Sanitarium. Yes. What does that do? Everyone, draw a card. And everyone, <laughs> discard a card. What you discarding, Alex? I discarded this planes. I'm discarding a burnout. Ooh. <laughs> Could have just throw me in the trash, I understand. I think I'm gonna discard this chain of vapor. Tight. I'm gonna discard an ancient tomb. Very nice, very nice. Cool deal. Alrighty, then we'll untap a roo, as they say in the business. God, I should put Guy Reach in this deck. <laughs> it's really good with Spirit of the Labyrinth. Confirm. Yeah. Really mad that you left mana up, Wheeler. Oh. I mean, nice of you. it's not very cash money of you. I, I just don't want to die to Aurelia. I mean, I understand. I'm just mad about it. Oh, uh, we're going to cast Steel Shaper's Gift. Uh, uh, for two mana. Uh, yeah, one more. One Uno Mas. So demanding. Um, actually, thing. just for ease of use and fun for everyone. I'm also going to cast Reperial Recruiter, even though that's not legal, just so I can get both of my tutors out of the way. Okay. Uh, sure. Sure. Any objections? No. Uh, no I do have a Sutra Priest uh, trigger, but oh. other than that, you're good to go. Uh, go to uh, yes. All righty. So off my totally legit Imperial Recruiter, we're going to find this Grand Abolisher. And off my Steel Shaper's Gift, we will find this Helm of the Host. Now that one I'm shocked and appalled by. Well, I yeah. will be too, because it's a... Uh, Pretty, pretty, pretty good. So those will both go to my hand. We'll pay two planes for a grand abolisher. Yeah, seems good. Yep. 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 Any effects? Mm -hmm. Uh, I will Whoa. respond. Well, I have a triggered ability as well. Uh, the triggered ability for you to lose one from my suture priest. Uh, I am also going to Whoa, lo, 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 lo. pay three. I'm going to have to tap all of these things due to... Yeah, it's really uh, unfortunate that mana burn isn't a thing anymore. <laughs> yeah. Got him. More soul was, like, much better back then. Uh, I'm going to activate my Eldrazi Displacer twice. Uh, once blinking your Aurelia, the War Leader, and the okay. other uh, blinking Thrasios, uh, causing Suture Priest to trigger twice. Yep. Uh, so they come back to play tapped. Yes, Elliot, or not Elliot. 
Uh, yeah, and then uh, Abolisher is good. Okay. Uh, questions, comments, concerns? Zero. Nope. That's it. All righty, untap. Draw. Command tower as my land for turn. Mm. Oh, let's see. What are we doing? Is the answer going for it? What are you doing if you're not doing that? True. Uh, well, I am going to take another life off of this Talisman of Indulgence uh, so that I don't have to tap uh, my lands just yet. And then two from a soul ring to cast, uh, what is this? My my third uh, demonic tutor of the game? Something like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, any effects, have have Jan? Jan, any effects? Uh, yeah, I have no effects. Wield. Oh, go off. Uh, I'm going to get this card off of my demonic tutor. And do Alex, do? don't you dare, because you're going to see he it already again. Did. He already did. Uh, five mana, got to pay two more because of this freaking... War's Toll. Oh. Uh, and then I'm going to pay for more life because this is a Toxic Deluge. Ooh. Ooh. Mm. Ooh, yo. Toxic Delugio, you say? I do. Uh, X equals four, you said? X equals four. I have a, a black mana floating, if it, if it matters to anybody. Well, thanks for letting us know what was floating. Yeah, um, no problem. Jan, you got anything? Uh, I do not. I think overall this is probably good to let go. Yeah. Oh, uh, well, actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna float a green. Sure. All right. I got nothing. Whee! Alrighty. Pass a turn. Uh, end of your turn. Um. Gonna spend a treasure to cast an anointing tutor. I think you just spent four treasures. <laughs> I did spend four treasures. I'm gonna spend one treasure. There you go. Dead. That seems better. Uh, yeah. Any effects to a line tutor, guys? Nope. You go for it. Okay. Uh, so I'm gonna go get this grim monolith, put it on top of my library, and I'll put this enlightened tutor into the exile zone. Seems good. Mm -hmm. Untap. Draw this grim monolith. What? It's crazy. It is crazy. I agree. Uh, pay one life, make a green, spend a treasure, make a blue, cast a Grim Monolith. Well, I think you got to tap that command tower too. Yes. Worst oh, yeah. Uh, Worst toll. Just that. Uh, just make the treasure back or, or spend that mana. You have a mana floating. It doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, uh, then I will tap for three colorless. Mm hmm. Use this. Uh, spend one colorless uh, and two treasures to make uh, two red. Cast Zerda. Oh, that's not good for us. Uh, which should let me spend the remaining two colorless I have to untap my Grimmonolith. Mm -hmm. And uh, I can repeat this. Hmm? No, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, have, I have no effects to anything so far. Or uh, so at all, because I'm generate, tapped out. <laughs> uh, 800 million colorless mana. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I will one. spend two treasures for a green and a blue. I will cast a Thrasios. Yeah. Wow, it's even cheaper because he has the training grounds in play. Unbelievable. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so I'm basically going to do this till I draw my walk and stuff. I'm yeah. Activate Thrasios. Yep. We'll, uh, yeah, let's uh, time skip this, I guess, because you're going to yeah. put a bunch of lands into play, right? Yeah. Yeah. So I'm just going to keep, I'm going to do it and we're just going Okay, so now that I found my walking ballista and gone through most of my deck, uh, I'm gonna cast this walking ballista for uh, I don't know. It doesn't even have to be that much. Million. Yeah, I'm whatever. at nine. <laughs> yeah, 
A hundred, yeah. So I'm gonna shoot Wheeler for thirty two, shoot oh. Alex for twenty nine, shoot Elliot for nine. Yeah. I'm dead. dead. Go to dead step. Same. Let's uh let's cut back here. Anybody got any any thoughts about that about that game? I was uh, when when Jan was saying when I uh, when I played my uh, uh, your audio, yeah. Sorry, what's up? Me? Oh, no, you're good. Okay, um, my uh, what should we call it? When I um, when Jan was saying you must have the win in hand, I had uh, Doomsday, Dark Ritual, and Bubbling Muck for like mm-hmm. most of that game. And uh, yeah, just like couldn't uh, couldn't put it together because of you know the stuff, the so, torpor orb, and then the suture priest, and then the, yeah. yeah the so Thalia. the last two cards I had in my hand before that were uh, dispel and silence. So if you'd cast Doomsday, I would have silenced. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, but that's what I was trying to figure out. I was like, okay, there's a Thalia in play. I have to cast a silence so nobody can do anything. And then I realize everyone's tapped out. I'm like, okay, I still have to pay these taxes. Do I have enough? And then you toxic deluged. And I was like, oh, I have just enough to... To kill us. Yeah. To make it happen. Uh, wow, that's really good. Um, so on my side of stuff, uh, the turns after I played my Torpor Orb, I drew Imperial Fruit Recruiter into Recruiter the card, <laughs> which was kind of brutal. Yeah, um, yeah. Obviously, once it went down, that was nice. Uh, but... Uh, my plan for next turn was to recruit the guard into Treasure Nabber, mm. which would have been great because it would have shortcut uh, Jan's plans and hopefully got me enough mana to redo that. But it's yeah. just really unfortunate. Yeah, stacks um, pieces didn't quite get us there. Yeah, I so my turn two uh, when I played Kinnon, I wanted to play my um, Dockside. He's like, oh, we've had a full round where nobody played any artifacts. And the first artifact or enchantment anyone played was Alex <laughs> playing a Torpor Orb. Yeah. When I like, I would have even like, if there was one out, I'd play it because Kenyon makes it two mana off the treasure, and I can like start doing stuff. Um, but yeah, and then Wheeler with the Suture Priest made the like blinking with a meal like not a great idea. Right. If I'd gotten there, so yeah. I, uh, that Wars Toll. I think maybe I should have shifted gears a little bit after the Soul Ring, where I can Soul Ring and Rich Port. To try and keep people tapped down a bit. It doesn't mm. work. I was kind of hopeful with Wars Toll. It's like, oh, if I port one land, do they have to tap everything? Which oh. no, it does not work like that. But no. still, I think it might have been a bit of a better use considering how restricted everybody was. But I was gonna say, yeah, without that Wars Toll, I'm pretty sure you could have just like kept me out of the game because I was stuck on literally two lands for that entire game. Yeah, I was kind of getting to a spot where my draw like drawing more lands with kind of already anemic beats was a little iffy but like yeah the i i think it would have been fine if wars tool didn't kind of lock me out of Mm. trying to do certain oh basically use my mana how i wanted to use my mana but again that's what the card does so yeah 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 well uh, that was a pretty good game, I think. We might yeah. uh, we might yeah. play another one. We might play, you know, you know we'll we'll see. The day the day is young. Um, mm, Wheeler, yes. well, well, plug yeah. plug yourself a little bit, my my buddy. Sure. Yeah. Uh, so I stream four or five days a week over at twitch.tv slash Benjamin underscore Wheeler. Uh, I'm a Twitch partnered streamer that streams primarily Magic Arena or Magic Online with the occasional webcam magic thing uh, or like Legends of Runeterra, but mostly card related and things that are powerful. Um, if I'm not there, I'm over at twitch.tv slash loading ready run. Uh, and I can be found on Twitter at, uh, at B Wheeler MTG. Yeah. Ben's good people. If you're yeah, watching this video, you probably already knew that, but you know, good, good Canadian kid, good Canadian yeah. kid. Check them out. Check obviously you. Uh, they they don't need our help, but check out LRR. They they also do great yeah. stuff. Right? Yeah, it's pretty, pretty all right. <laughs> you know, you oh, gotta they're... keep it in the keep it in the Canadian family. Yeah, exactly. And, uh, yeah. yeah. So uh, yeah, we'll uh, catch you guys next time. Thanks so much for watching the Spike Feeders. We'd like to give a shout out to each and every one of the patrons that we have, along with those that appear on this page. We'd also like to give a special shout out to Christopher, Luca, and Connor our $50 patrons. We do what we do because of support like yours. Thank you all so much. Stick around 
watch another video, or click here and we'll take you to another piece of great Spike Feeders content. Thanks again for watching.